Hi friends, welcome to Positive Power with your host Michelle Dion. Thank you for joining me for another week. Oh my word, is it ever hot out? Is it hot or what? Wow, um, you know, didn't really expect that. Not, we have the cold, everything is just so weird with weather anymore, isn't it? I mean, everything is absolutely extreme. So we had hot, 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 then it went to cool and we pulled the air conditioners out and people closed the pools and now it's hot again. And they're saying it's hot for a few more days. So I'm asking you now, first of all, be safe. If it's too hot in your place, don't stay there. Go somewhere, go hang out with a friend, go stay with some family, go to the mall, um, go to a coffee shop, go somewhere where they have some cool air for you. Very important, especially if you're older, if you're a baby, if you have um, any sort of illness that you're not 100% up to your game, um, breathing disorder, definitely um, very important. And make sure ta -da, we drink some water, right? Join me in a glass of water. Mmm, mmm, so good for you, even when it's not hot. So this week I wanted to touch base with you and see how's it going? How's it going with taking back control of your life? You know, we talked about your four powers. We talked about the power of your thoughts the power of your food, your your medicine, and then the power of your money. So how's it all tied in for you? Have you done any, you know, thinking about it, taking control, research some stuff? Um, how about controlling your mood? I just saw a meme on Facebook and they were actually talking about that, about how you have control over how you feel. Now, like anything new, it is, you know, it's a new habit. It's trial and error. It's doing it and figuring out what works for you. What makes you feel good? What gives you happy thoughts? You know, a great idea is something that makes you feel good. Um, like a picture. So let's say you have a, a new baby in your life or an old baby in your life, whatever. You have a baby in your life. Maybe a picture of one of your kids when they were a baby. Hey, maybe a picture, maybe you have a fur baby. So. Why don't you take some pictures of your animal, your, your child, whatever. Maybe it's a picture of the mountains. When I see the mountains out west, oh my gosh, I swear, my heart just starts to hum. Love it. So, what I can do, for example, is, and what I have done, is I've put positive pictures that make me feel good all around places I am. I have pictures on the, my freezer, on my fridge. So, I level, I go there, I see happy thoughts, right? Happy pictures. Um, on my visor, in my dash, in my car, I flip it down. Oh, look, there's a picture that makes me feel good, right? In my room, someone gave me a beautiful picture a few years ago of the flower of life. And, oh, it's got all different purples and it's absolutely gorgeous. It's right beside my bed. So when I'm in key parts of my home that I'm in all the time, or my car that, trust me, I'm in all the time, definitely, I look around, it makes me feel good. You know another fun thing that I've done and oh, some of the meetings I go to, they laugh at me, is I've actually set alarms on my phone um, to go off at certain times and when they go off, they give me inspiring messages. So my phone will go off and somebody will be like, hey Michelle, you have a phone call or, or whatever, you must have got a message or something and I go and I look and it's just this lovely little jingle and it says, I can accomplish anything. I am amazing. I am awesome. Whatever I programmed it to do. And it comes at different sporadic times. Why don't you try that? Use your technology for good, right? So just different things that you can do that you can incorporate into your day to day to make you feel good, to make you feel uplifted. You know, you can't, like now, because I've been doing this for years, I can change my mood pretty quick. I can do it just from closing my eyes. But I've been doing this for a long time. I still need things around my house. If you came to my house, you'd like crap up, crack up laughing because I've got pictures of all sorts of people all over the place. But that's what makes me feel good, right? It's like I live in a collage and that's okay. So think about it. What makes you feel good? Put pictures of representation of that all over and don't forget your car. We are in our cars a lot. And before we go, I just want to remind you, end of October, free clothing drive. It'll be the fourth one we've done, so very pleased. The last Sunday in October. Save the date, 
save some clothes and no qualifiers so I don't care who you are where end of town you live in anything you need some stuff please come we will help so thanks so much have a great week don't forget how awesome you are you're absolutely amazing and there's nothing you can't have when you put your mind on it <laughs>